All right, today is March 22nd, Friday. Back at the same spot I was yesterday. Uh, I wanted to go to the southern portion, but all the trails are closed. I drove 30 minutes in the wrong direction, and I had to come back here. Uh, so I'll ride that portion that I missed yesterday. Today is a very nice, beautiful, 83 degrees at the moment. Oh my god. Ah. Sunny. It looks like things have dried up since yesterday. All right. I tighten the seat. So hopefully today it doesn't start bending down again. I think I took everything, I think everything is closed. There's a few more cars here today. It's not that surprising. It's it's Friday. around where I left off yesterday. Surprisingly muddy, it, I guess it rained overnight, but it's weird, sections of the trail are drier, but there's more puddles. I think I fixed the seat too, I don't think it was the bike seat. I think it was the Walmart seat. I think one of the bolts came loose. I don't know if you can tell on camera, but this section right here is very steep. This is cool. This is speedometer right here. And miles per hour. That's okay. Have a good day. You too. I'm already running to a number of people, unlike yesterday. Friday, more people are out. Which is nice. Jeez. 
But yeah, like I was saying yesterday, this bike is holding up incredibly well considering the things I'm putting it through. The soil around here, I think, is actually pretty decent. It looks dark. The trees are big. That's kind of how you can tell where the better soil is. The soil's just rocks or limestone. I think it's limestone. Um, the trees sort of look, well, they're a lot smaller. Um, but while the soil is decent, it has a ton of rocks in it in the soil, so like these trails, like this is a smooth section, but like in most sections have giant, really sharp rocks just jutting out of the ground. Actually, let me, I'm gonna try this, this mount right here. Okay, now it's mounted to my handlebars. Kind of like it mounted uh, to my chest, but it's it seems to point too much at the ground, and I can't I can't adjust it anymore up just because of the design of the holster. Uh, on here, I think it looks better, but then it also looks like a drone. Like you can't really see the bike. It just kind of looks like you're floating over everything. short but really nice section from what I remember. Try to go through here a little bit slower. I've been seeing a lot of videos online of snakes in these like this tall grass rattlesnakes. seen any yet myself.
beautiful day, sunny in the 80s. Friend Tom texted the group chat today, sent the video, it was snowing. It's pretty crazy. Very steep. Let's see. You know what? Maybe I can ride down this. All right, I'm going to attempt to get back up now. The trail's almost vertical in this spot. Let's see. Pedaling with pedal assist if I'm able to get up. Ah. Nah. Almost. This section right here is really steep too. Yeah, so far this bike has been great.
prickly pear cactus in sections of the park. And they're putting out new pads now in a couple weeks. I think they'll be fully grown and they, they'll flower. Back to the Philip Bauer house. Oh. So this is what I was talking about with the prickly pear. I don't know if this comes across in the camera, but you can see the new pads, the leaves or whatever you want to call them, they're coming in. Some of these have bigger, bigger pads already. see the flowers from last year. I was pedaling right there and it auto engages pedal assist and I stop and there's like a good second or two where it still keeps going. Oh, oh big rocks. Jeez. I know. 
on the path? Oh, I think I am. Ah, this is my favorite little section. It's very, oops. It's very great, I might go in fast enough to ride over this. Trying to enjoy this little little piece of the trail. So this is I always find very cool, like the Spanish moss in the trees. Especially being from the north, you never see that. did it again it stopped pedaling and it kept going I don't think you can really see it on camera either but there's so many leaves on the ground but this is another really rocky section I took this trail yesterday, but I went the opposite direction. I think it's a little bit harder in this direction. It's slightly uphill. There's a few more parks I wanted to see in the area. Just haven't had the time to get out to them because they're further out. This is about 20 some minutes from where I live. The other parks are around an hour. There's a few parks, parks I want to see in East Texas too, but those are really far. bike set to the right gear going uphill I gotta do that oh. yeah so like these rocks are Especially right here are like razor blades. These tires are really impressive. Like I've flown over these rocks. Going pretty fast. These tires just bounce right off. Them. I'm 
this is way easier downhill. Water was pouring down this trail. Oh boy. Nasty section. I didn't realize this was this path when I got on it. Would have gone a different way. That's good. This is the end of this really rocky section. Take this out. 